Have you ever thought of doing real and effective teaching in a virtual immersive world? In a time when our modern educational system is under fire for being disconnected from the real world, many secondary school teachers see virtual worlds as a tool that might help them to connect students to the real-life education. The Avatar Project introduced secondary school teachers to the use of virtual worlds for teaching and learning through a moderated online course, the culmination of which was a virtual laboratory, virtual learning environment involving their students in collaborative activities in a virtual world. Avatar stands for Added Value of Teaching in a Virtual World. It's a European co-funded project under the Lifelong Learning Comenius program. The Avatar project conducted desk research and interviews with experts on virtual learning, best practices and a comparative analysis on existing virtual worlds, in which the quality of the available teaching and learning facilities was scrutinized. Subsequently, the Avatar project designed and produced a course for secondary school teachers on teaching and learning in virtual worlds, delivered through an e-platform for the content, discussion board and administration, and on a v-platform built on Second Life for the practical exercises. The hub is the point of entry into the Avatar estate. It's intended to offer information about the Avatar project, partners, destinations and short user guides. The Resource Center offers textures, scripts, object accessories and teaching aids for teachers and students to collect free of charge. The auditorium holds up to 100 users simultaneously and is used for presentations, seminars and conferences. The Sandbox is a location where teachers and students can place and create objects, discuss their experiences and do their project works. The Dissemination Path provides teachers and classes with campsites for presenting and sharing their activities in world. More than 120 secondary school teachers from Austria, Bulgaria, Denmark, Italy, Spain and the UK piloted the Avatar course from January to May 2011. The course was divided into two main parts. The first referred to theoretical and practical knowledge, such as how to navigate around and communicate with other avatars, how to develop contents, and how to create educational pathways. During the course, guided tours, lessons and seminars by invited speakers were carried out in real time in Second Life. The second part involved teachers realizing their learning scenarios and experimenting their project work with small groups of their students in many different disciplines. English and French as a foreign language, mathematics, history, chemistry and ecology, science, astrophysics, philosophy, literature, law and economics. A virtual world can add value to your real-life teaching. It overcomes physical limits. It's a real-world simulation and allows role-playing. It adds a practical dimension to teaching and learning activities. It promotes collaborative working environment. It creates an emotional and social impact. And it's up to your creativity. If you are interested in setting up similar activities, come and see the added value of teaching in a virtual world. Visit the Avatar website at www.avatarproject.eu and our Avatar Island in Second Life.